Israelis are now used to this scene. The Knesset Constitution Committee, ground zero for the judicial overhaul, where Tuesday committee members marked up the bill to change the panel that picks judges, set for a vote in the full Knesset plenum by the end of next week. We are united in correcting, just as we promised you, citizens of Israel. But it is important to us to make sure to do so responsibly, in a balanced way that takes into account the views of our brothers who do not agree with our positions. The coalition's move to soften and delay the overhaul has not yet calmed the storm in Israel, with new warnings Tuesday of economic and social collapse, with protesters still expected to block roads on Thursday, and with key reservists saying they will step up their protest. We have been saying this for several weeks. The People's Army can only exist in a democracy. If the laws are enacted, we and tens of thousands more who are with us will stop volunteering in the reserves. In principle, the coalition is still set to pass other parts of the original overhaul after the Passover recess. In practice, the expectation is that they too will be whittled down. And then the question will be whether the storm dies down too, or whether the intensity of feeling in Israel continues to shape the country, and whether the Supreme Court decides to strike down a law on how its justices are picked, leading to a true clash between the parliament and the court.